The Holy Spirit, James Smith, The Way of Salvation Set Forth. That which is born of the flesh is flesh, and that which is born of the Spirit is spirit. John 3 6. The Holy Spirit is the author of the great work of regeneration. He takes up his abode in the renewed heart as his temple. He dwells in us and shall be with us. Jesus does all for us in our justification, and the Holy Spirit does all in us for our sanctification. The Holy Spirit is the source of all holy desires, consistent purposes, and good works. There is no good thing in us but what He produces. He dwells within us as the teacher, the comforter, and the advocate of the soul. He leads us into truth against Satan and to labor for God. He warns us of evil, directs us to Jesus, and applies the blessings of salvation to our souls. He is in us as a well of water springing up into everlasting life. Without the Holy Spirit, there is not, there cannot be, genuine religion, for He is its author, guardian, and guide. To Him we are indebted for every good desire, for every holy thought, for every good word, and for every fruitful work. He works in us to will and to do of His own good pleasure. Every tear of penitence, every contrite sigh, every fervent prayer, every ray of spiritual light, every holy emotion toward God is from the Holy Spirit. If He left us, our graces would soon wither, fade, and die. When we grieve Him, our comforts decline, our evidences are beclouded, and our hands wax feeble. But if we sow to the Spirit, if we walk in the Spirit, if we aim in all things to please Him, then our souls are vigorous, our graces are lively, and we are enabled to find our joy in God.